Part two or part three. Placing the contact to HVAC people. Contact for a heater. It was pitted real bad and making a loud buzzing noise. I think this is the original contact for this unit in 1993. So, we got it money worth on this one. About 20 some years old. Make sure we good. 120, 110, 120 core. All right, sound good to me. Yep. Use our same existing hose. I love HVAC though, people. That's what I do. Say so when you doing something you love to do, it ain't like work. Something like that. So you doing something you love, you never work a day of your life, something like that. What they're saying? Fool me once, shame on. What what Bush say? Shame on. Uh, yeah, you know. All right, put these right here. My 120 volt, my 120 common. I'm gonna have to script this out right here, put a, uh, a female on there. So let's see what we got. Right, make sure you got the right tool so, so everything will go smooth. Put these up. Hope it'll be long enough so I won't have to add lid. Saturday, a little overtime. We want everything to go smooth today. We can go watch some football. Playoff time. Make a couple extra dollars. Like I say, working overtime. It's like an extra job, or to me, I don't know how you get ahead when you're working a job anyway. You gotta work a little extra job or work some overtime. You know, get out of debt. That's what the goal is. 2018, we we trying to be debt free. All right, got that in there. That one smooth. I'm gonna get, give me a fill up here. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, get it. If you're in school for HVAC though, keep at it. It's gonna pay off one day. If I was y'all, I'd start go ahead and start filling out applications right now for the summertime. See if you can get in right now and work, work, uh, Work part time, like 10, 10 hours out the week or something like that to you. Let them know. Work a couple hours out the week. See if you can be a helper. Ain't no need to wait till you get out of school and graduate before you start putting them applications in. You might well start now. You know, put, put your name out there first. Before you know, any of your classmates. You know, they're gonna wait till they graduate. You might well go get ahead. I'm talking about every HVAC company uh, in your city or town or whatever. Let them know. All right, got that changed out. So I think we done. Make sure ain't nothing touching. See, it's like having some zip ties in here. I like to keep my zip ties somewhere in here. Need to be more better organized. I go one. I like to keep them right here. Put all my jumpers and my tape. I got a 
refill with zip tie. I got a bag of zip tie about 5,000 out there. All right. Put that right there. Make it look good. All right. Well, that's one thing we do not want this low voltage to touch. Okay, is it my off right here that's on right there? Incoming voltage should be right here. But I seen a washer that's sitting up inside. That's 480 volts coming through there. So we want to get that washed out of there. Just so happen to see it. But I want to be very careful. So I just want to check my voltage. I want to go home and watch the football today. I got, like I said, I got three more units to run. Like I say, just replace the heated contact and move my supply air to uh, temperature sensor. See that washer up in there? I think that's dangerous. Okay. So I'm going to get it out of there. I just want to check voltage first. Check voltage. Put your black lead to ground. Just go to every one of them. Every one of them. Every one of them. One, two, and three. So the bottom should be my incoming voltage. You want to check and make sure. Yep. Yeah, see it. 286, 282, 230. All right, but I'm still gonna use this right here with rubber leaves and get this wire nut out of here. See, look, stuff like this the customers don't see, but hey, Make you a better man, you know you did the right thing. It just took one minute. All right, peace out though, H back people. Well, let's see how much time we got. I might, yeah, I might just turn it on for you, see what we got. All right, I, tu I turned it off on a uh, emergency stop. So, going through a fob, you're gonna tur turn it back on right here. So we should be good to go. I'm going to clean up. I got a bunch of clutter. My little sandwich carrier. I use it to put all my little wire nuts in there. Need to empty all this stuff out in there. Male and female. Spade. Self tappers, clean it up, throw all that away in the garbage. Alright, peace out, four. Who you got this year? I got them Saints. I'm a Texas fan, but I like them Saints too, so that's who I'm riding with this year. Let's go, Saints.